basket and just couldn't get it to, to go down. Wilson and Taylor a little out of control with their dribble. Got away with it there. Didn't lose the handle on the ball. And Higgins gets it still with 18 on the clock for Leon. Higgins off the screen. Draws triple coverage. And there's Whitney City wide open. you got to find that balance in there where you can say, hey, I can count on Jake Vanderheiden for 15 every night or 12 or whatever it is. By Higgins, he has his first two in a while. 21 total. This teardrop will not fall for Funk. And now Knox with their biggest lead trying to add to its 17-pointer. But Higgins kicks it out for an open three by Taylor, and he'll bang that one in, and it's 20 up on Sunday. And here's another teardrop missed off the glass that time, but the rebound comes to the Malnogs for an open three, and Higgins hits it. Again. A little handoff screen there. Unfortunate one go down for Xander Rice. So the Malnogs, that has been Bucktail's trouble here tonight, haven't been able to get some shots to fall. Malnogs will get it out to Wilson. That's Jamiro. Over to Higgins, has a new career high in assists and shots. Here's uh, Finn catch and shoot three, and he'll bury it. He's trying to give it to Timmerman. He'll just push off with the left hand, but missed the jumper. And the Mount Knox clear another rebound. Had 19 dead ball rebounds last time. And here's an open three by Lynch, and he bangs it in. And game in a number of games. Last time out against Loyola, he had 10. But the Mount Knox still lead it by 22 points. Here's an open three by Fitton, and that's the problem when you play a Zox. Get it back, leading it almost by 30 points here today. As we said, Bucknell gave up 96 to Army last time. Here's an easy shot by Higgins, and he adds to it.